Welcome to the Neurology Channel, a YouTube channel dedicated to all things neurology. We have a passion for sharing our knowledge and experience with others. On this channel, we cover a wide range of topics related to the brain and nervous system, including common neurological conditions, diagnostic tests, and treatment options. We also discuss the latest research and developments in the field of neurology. Whether you're a medical professional looking to stay up to date with the latest research, or a patient interested in learning more about the brain and how it works, the Neurology Channel has something for you. So, if you're interested in all things neurology, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. Thanks for stopping by and we can't wait to share more about the fascinating world of neurology with you. In this video, we'll be talking about post-herpetic neuralgia, a condition that can occur after a person has had shingles. Let's dive in and learn more about this important condition. What is post-herpetic neuralgia? Post-herpetic neuralgia, PHN, is a chronic pain condition that occurs after a person has had shingles, a viral infection that causes a painful rash. PHN is caused by nerve damage that occurs during the shingles infection. Symptoms and Impacts of Post-Herpetic Neuralgia PHN is characterized by persistent pain that can last for months or even years after the shingles rash has healed. The pain can be severe and can interfere with a person's daily activities, such as sleeping, working, and socializing. Other symptoms may include sensitivity to touch, itching, and numbness. Treatments for Post-Herpetic Neuralgia There are several treatments available to help manage the pain associated with PHN including medications such as antidepressants, anticonvulsants, and opioids. In addition, nerve blocks and other procedures may be recommended to help alleviate the pain. Coping with post-herpetic neuralgia. Living with PHN can be challenging, but there are things that can be done to help manage the pain and improve quality of life. These may include exercise, relaxation techniques, and counseling or support groups. Research and progress. Researchers are actively working to develop new treatments for PHN and to better understand the underlying causes of the condition. Some promising areas of research include the development of new medications and therapies, as well as the use of advanced imaging techniques to better understand the nerve damage that occurs in PHN. In conclusion, post-herpetic neuralgia is a chronic pain condition that can occur after a person has had shingles. While the pain associated with PHN can be severe and long-lasting, there are treatments available to help manage the pain and improve quality of life. We hope this video has provided you with useful insights into post-herpetic neuralgia. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching the Neurology Channel. We hope you found this video informative and useful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel if you want to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. We post new content every week so make sure to check back often for more insights and information on all things neurology. If you're interested in learning more about a specific topic, let us know in the comments and we'll do our best to cover it in a future video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.